everybody and welcome back to yet another video. Today we're going to be doing a suggestion review. This was suggested by my friend Dynico42. Thank you so much for suggesting this. His videos are great. He just started a new stop motion series and it's been great so far. And uh, thank you for making uh, me. So, let's begin with the review of Jeff Gorvet. Now, I got a problem. If you saw my Francesco review yesterday, you'd know that Francesco actually was upgraded a few years later to have black on his base. He wasn't the only uh, WGP car upgraded and updated to have a new uh, design. New Jeff Corvettes have a uh, little Corvette logo right there on like the nose area. Doesn't matter though. It's it's still him. So let's get started. On the back you can see World Grand Prix, and I'm pretty sure, yeah, it's green. He's obviously angry. He's got a really cool design. You can see all the cool different, like, little uh, air scoops and other things that are supposed to help him uh, pick up speed when he's racing. He is obviously angry. Too bad they didn't change his expression on the Cars 3 version. Really, really, really hoping to get that. He would be great in my series, and he's just awesome. I, I uh, love Jeff Corvette as a character. One of my favorite WGP cars, aside from... Uh, uh, my favorites are uh, Raul, Carla, and uh, Shu Todoroki. Here you can see World Grand Prix and All in All down there in blue. And a really nice uh, red, white, and blue design, like a red stripe with a tw WGP 24. And a cool blue stars and stripes design. Obviously yellow here with uh, weird dots all over him. Here's the door with some dots on it as well. And on the back you could see World Grand Prix powered by all in all. Two, I mean, two lights on either side. Uh, American flag WGP 24. He obviously is based off of the real racer uh, Jeff Gordon, who actually inspired the plot for Curse 3, there's his bumper, which is odd that he has a bumper, and there, of course, is his base. So, apparently, uh, John Lasseter is good friends with, uh, uh, Jeff Gordon, and when he was, re and when he had to be retired and replaced at an early age, I believe he was only 43, when he was retired and replaced with a different racer, that actually inspired the plot for Cars 3, which is nice and interesting. Now, speaking of Cars 3, he's probably most similar in any car, like, ever to Tim Treadless or Bubba Wheelhouse, not the tow truck. I don't have uh, Bubba yet, Wheelhouse or the tow truck. You can see they are pretty similar in shape, especially when uh, compared side to side. He's practically unique for uh, World Grand Prix cars, though. There is really no one like him. McQueen, and eh, maybe a little, but, uh, yeah. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Thank you, Danico42. And remember, if you ever have a car, uh, just let me know who you want, uh, a car you want me to review. Just let me know. Bye now.